what it is, man. It's big L's in this bitch, you heard me? Sweet niggas mad and nah. Real quick, bro. Real quick, cause we about to get straight to the beans and rice, you heard me? I'ma keep it a bean with you, bro. This nigga Bill Collector is tripping. You geeking, bro. You hear me? You is geeking. You feel me? And to keep it all the way being like, I feel like you being disingenuous. I feel like it's very, it's very childish and it's very childish and disingenuous of you to discredit Aver being a legend simply because he discredited you. You feel me? Like that's childish and shit. That's tit for tat. Like I don't give a fuck what a nigga say about me. I'm not going to ignore. Like I'm not going to ignore the truth about somebody. Just because I want to have something negative to say about them because I feel like they did or say something that was offensive. A verb is a legend. As much as I do not like this nigga right now, I think he suck right now. I think he ass, bro. Like, dude, dude he be getting smoked by bitches. You feel me? The nigga be doing a lot of talking. You feel me? He don't rap that good. Well, he don't battle rap that good right now. But to say he not a legend, I would be lying. I'll be lying to myself. The nigga is a legend. You cannot tell the story of mid rap of Midwest battle rap without a verb. And he, bro, he put on a lot of your favorite battle rappers. He ushered a lot of them niggas in. That in itself is legendary. Official, Hitman Holler, Young Ill. Uh, it's a few niggas. Probably Remedy. Like it's a yo. It's a lot of Midwest legends. That 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 came through a verb uh, doors, bro. Yeah, niggas be forgetting about uh, what it, what, it, what it was called, uh, word wars or some shit like that. Like the the, the battle rap league he had in um St. Louis, and this was like damn near like pretty much like around the inception, like around the time of the inception of URL. Like uh, maybe a little bit before that. That's how that's how smacking them knew about. Ill and Hitman and Verb because uh, uh 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 yo gave him the platform. A Verb gave him the platform. So like I, I like I get A Verb be talking hella shit and yeah I mean he be talking out his ass sometimes. He be saying shit. Most of the time I agree with him. You feel me? I'm gonna keep it a being with you. Like he be logical, but sometimes the nigga do be talking out his ass. You feel me? So I get it. And it, and it's something good to say. Like we, like we know how it is, man. When you going back and forth with a nigga. It's like, it, it, it kind of defeats the purpose to give them compliments. It, like, it defeats the purpose of, like, uh, of being at odds with somebody or, be, or having a dispute with somebody to, to, to be in a compliment battle, to be saying nice things about them. It, like, you feel me? Like, come on, I guarantee you when these niggas kiss and make up, or if they kiss and make up, the niggas gonna be like, yeah, I was tripping, bro. I was just talking shit. I done seen you niggas do it a thousand times, bro. Y'all be like, yeah, I ain't really mean that. I only said that because you said this. Like, come on. You might believe that you believe that right now. You feel me? Because niggas is, I don't want to say niggas being emotional, but niggas is in their feelings. You feel me? So you got to, you got to relax, bro. I just, I like, as a man. I feel like at all times you gotta attempt to be logical. You gotta attempt to tell the truth, bro. Regardless of how it may make you feel to say something nice about a person when they just saying the most fucked up shit in the world about you. And you get what I'm saying? But still, like, it says a lot about your character and it speaks volumes about you. Like, keep it a bean, bro. Like, let's keep it a bean. A verb is a certified legend. He's not just a vet, bro. He's not, he is a vet. He's a legend also, bro. And that nigga was dangerous back in the day. Like, Bill, you wasn't fucking with Averb back in the day. That nigga was dangerous, bro. You feel me? And like, that nigga was dangerous, bro. And he was one of a kind, so. I don't know, bro. I ain't gonna say put some respect on his name, just. That's not. That's not lose sight of the truth, bro. You feel me? That's not a lot of ourselves. For the for for the uh for the sake of defamating the nigga, you feel me? The nigga is a fucking legend, regardless of what anybody say, regardless of how trash he is these days. He's a legend, bro. He's a fucking legend. That's why he's able to fuck up and then still get booked to battle. Not saying vets. I mean, it's vets that do the same shit, but 
when you got legendary status, it's like you can damn near do no wrong. You feel me? You always gonna be able to eat in battle rap. You always gonna be able to get a battle. You always gonna be able to get a bag, bro. Cause you like you're one of the pillars of battle rap. Like this shit is stapled in this culture. So Bill definitely geeky, man. That's just my perspective. Big L's in his best. You mad enough.